Welcome back, Seth Ling here. Yesterday I made a video showing the new bees that Mojang added to Minecraft Snapshot 19w34a. This is the first 1.5 snapshot. And today I want to show you a data pack that I made that adds writability to the bees. They are quite big and chunky. <laughs> so uh, it's really simple to use. You just right click on a bee with a saddle. Um, it doesn't change the bee's AI or anything, but if you then right click on the bee, you can ride it. Whoops, I uh, dismounted. You can ride it. Uh, you press shift to dismount just like any other animal. And I added a flower on a stick <laughs> to, uh, to control the bee. So you'll notice that whichever direction I'm pointing, I will fly in that direction. Uh, you can also right click to dash. It creates a little short dash. So there's no durability on the on the flower on a stick. In fact, the flower on the stick is actually a poppy. If you look at the uh, item ID, it's actually just a retextured poppy. In fact, here's here's a bunch of planted flowers on a stick because they're actually just poppies. But it has some nice properties. Um, mainly that if you're holding a flower on a stick, since it's a poppy, the bee is attracted to it and he'll follow you around. So that's pretty nice. <laughs> because it, it makes it a lot easier to control the bees when you want to. Um, I actually think this would be nice, kind of make a nice addition to the game. Oh yeah, let's see what it looks like from F5 mode. Yeah, so the, the saddle, you know, doesn't fit perfectly on the bee. Uh, of course, the, the saddle is, is not actually on the bee itself. Um, let's go ahead and go to, yeah, it's actually, you know, a pig with a saddle on it. Basically what happens is when you have a saddle in your hand, and you look at a bee, like, uh, yeah, you can see it basically spawns an invisible pig. And so if you right click on the bee, it actually is right clicking on the pig and putting the saddle on the pig. And, oh, the bee, bee hurt itself there a little bit, it looked like, or no, the pig, the, sorry, the pig hurt itself because it, uh, <laughs> it sort of it suffocated in the wall, but the, the pig has infinite health, don't worry about the pig. So yeah, if you get close to the bee while you're holding a saddle, it'll get that invisible pig. Um, and then if you put the saddle on it, yeah, the, basically the pig gets teleported to the bee. So it follows the bee pretty well, except for when the bee is on the ground. Um, when the bee is on the ground, it's actually, its rotation is totally client side. It's, um, the server isn't really like overriding its rotation. So it doesn't know how to, how to orient the pig and, uh, make sure that the saddle orients to the bee. But, uh, but when it's flying around it, that works just fine. And, um. Yeah, you can ride the pig, ride the bee. <laughs> I, I, th I think this would actually be kind of cool in, in survival Minecraft. Uh, it's not like it's super overpowered. You do need a saddle and like the bee moves really slowly. Um, it's also kind of hard to store the bee. Uh, yeah, so I, <laughs> if you try and use a lead on this, just because of the way it's implemented with the pig, um, let's go out of F5 mode. Out of F5 mode. Uh, it really, it the lead kind of attaches to the pig and not the bee. It is possible to lead, like, lead a bee, and, and that works fine without, if it doesn't have a saddle on it. But um, it's, and I think it's even possible to attach it to the bee. Like, you you just have to get really lucky. No, it's still attached to the pig. Eh. <laughs> yeah, because the pig's hitbox basically just totally consumes the bees hitbox. So it's basically impossible to right click on the pig. So uh, the way I've been storing these bees is you can bring them over here. And if you dismount, <coughs> um, he will sit down because you're holding a flower and basically be, yeah, that's bee behavior. And then you can just close the doors. Oh, these other bees, <laughs> they came over to me. Uh, let's see. So let's ride this bee, put him in here. Whoops, uh, nope, open the doors. Yeah, and they won't try and like fly out really because you're holding that flower, and that's nice. <laughs> anyway, this was put together pretty fast. I'm sure there's a lot of ways in which this doesn't work very well. For instance, it wouldn't work in your offhand. Uh, anyway, there's there's a bunch of stuff like that. I just wanted to see what it would look like, and I think it looks pretty cool. And uh, yeah, if you want to download it for yourself, there's a link in the description to the data pack. You just put it in your world. One, make sure you're playing on the snapshot <laughs> so that there's actually bees, but. Uh, it just works just like you saw. That's about it. Thanks for watching.